Chad. How's it going? Oh man, it's uh, going very well. How are you doing, Caleb? Very good. Nice. Yeah. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our. Oh! Hello, Rachel. Welcome. Please, sit. Everyone, this is Rachel. This is her first day today. Please. If everyone can do it, introduce themselves. Hi, my name is Caleb. Nice to meet you, Caleb. My name is Rachel. Nice to meet you. Chad? Chad? Chad, I was saying, uh, uh, please introduce yourself to Rachel, or else I will send you to the principal's office. Hi, Rachel. Nice to meet you. My name is Chad. Hi, nice to meet you too, Chad. Good. Now that everyone's introduced themselves, it's time to start class. At 2 and 10 today, we are going to say show trailer time. Everyone's going to show a trailer. Capiche? Capiche. Capiche. Chad, do you want to be friends? No. Why not? You look like my ex-girlfriend, Brittany. Oh, okay. I understand. We could be friends as well? Sure. We can do things like go to the movies, have a nice dinner, go on a cruise, and travel the world. Uh, Rachel, we have class. You're going to make us late. Okay. Maybe someday. Rachel uh, said she wanted to be friends with me. Just say yes to her? No, I told her we should stay acquaintances. She, uh, she, uh, she said she wanted to tour the world with me. How would you take it? I told her we had class and she took it pretty well from there. At least she understands your feelings and emotions. I know, but doesn't it seem like she's just a little bit crazy? Yes. But you should give her a chance at least. Okay. okay. I'm so sorry, Chad. I didn't see you. What you did? It's all wet now. Completely ruined. I have to clean it and dry it for you. No, don't touch it. This was a new addition and it was worth a lot of money. Why did you have to be so mean? It's just an accident, I swear. Watch where you walk next time. You're overreacting. Dig a little. Over a small problem. It's just a book. No, I'm not. And no, it's not just a book to me. Get lost. <laughs> Sure. 
I don't want to hang out with you anymore. What's wrong, Jack? No. Me and Caleb are no longer friends. How come? Uh, we got into a fight over a text message. Um, so sorry? What's wrong, Rachel? Do you know something about that text? As a matter of fact, I do. What do you mean? Did you send that text message? Yes, I did. Why would you do that? I wanted to get back at you for making me cry when I ruined your textbook. Do you realize what you did? Yes. I lost a friend because of you. I know. Go. Get out of here. I don't want to see you anymore. I need to talk to you. I don't want to talk to you anymore. It's about the text. I know who sent it. You do? Who was it? It was Rachel. She told me herself. So you're telling me a sweet ATR girl sent me that text message? You gotta be kidding me. That's for yourself if you don't believe me. Why are you standing by the principal's office? He wanted to talk to me about something. Is it serious? I don't know yet. Why are you guys here? Because we need to talk to the principal about something, too. <laughs> what seems to be the matter, boys? Caleb and I are having trouble trusting each other. Can you tell me what happened? I got a text from his phone saying that I'm a loser and a bully. Who is it from? It was from his phone. Is this true, Chad? Did you send a text? It came from my phone, but I didn't send it. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean you didn't send it? Did someone else use your phone? Yes. Rachel, are you alright? Do you know who sent a text? No, I don't. Why do you assume I know anything? Um, it's because of the way you're acting. It's, it seems like you're nervous. Um, I don't know what you're talking about. This is always how I act. <sighs> Never mind. Just forget I asked. Sure. Okay, Chad, since you're not telling me the truth about sending the text, I'm going to have to give you detention every day after school for a week. Isn't there another way I can fix this? Well... You can't organize that about all of my cabinets. can't believe you still won't believe me. We've been friends for five years, and in that time, I haven't lied to you once. Jack, listen to me. How are your feelings? But I can't be with some of the lies. Friends with some of the lies. And the cell phone, it didn't come out of your backpack. It's been there the entire time. No. No, it can't be. I lost earlier today. It just lied to me for the last time. I can't be friends with someone who lies to me and isn't trustworthy. It was me. I sent the test. Why the heck did you send a text? I want to get back at Chad for making me cry. What did he do to make you cry? I ruined your I ruined his textbook and he yelled at me. How did you even send that text? You were walking, tripped over your shoe, and your phone fell out of your backpack. I pick it I pick up the phone. I sent the text to Caleb. And and put it back in the bag when you were looking. Let me see the phone. Okay, Caleb. You're free to go. Thanks. I need to talk with Chad and Rachel a little longer. Okay, 
Now, Chad, I want you to apologize to Rachel for yelling at her. Rachel, I'm I'm sorry. I guess I might have overreacted a little bit. It's okay, Chad. Now, Rachel, I will give you two options. You can either buy Chad a new textbook or be suspended for a month. I think I will buy him a new textbook because I don't want a suspension on my record. Good choice. You may be free to go.